Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to change calculator theme in your Windows. That's right, you can change it to dark theme or light theme. That way, sometimes I like mine darker because it's easier to read for me. Uh, you might like it in the light theme, but I'm going to show you actually how to do that in this video. But before we get going, hit the like on the video. It really helps out our channel. Also, hit the subscribe notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos we come out with every Thursday. I've been pretty consistent. 99.9% .9 of the time, I'm hitting Thursdays. It's usually late at night, so East Coast people might get it, you know, at 1 o'clock in the morning. So, <laughs> got a three hours difference. But that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So, what you want to do, you want to be on your Windows. I'm using Windows 10. This works a little bit. The You can find it on Windows 11, too. It will work the same way in the settings um, part. So what we're going to do is go down to the bottom and have your bottom menu come up. You can find your calculator by going to the start menu or just type in calculator. Oops, I hit the wrong button when I was doing that. That's not how you spell calculator. <laughs> there it is. Calculator pops up here. Uh, right here, you want to click on that and it's going to open your calculator up. Right now I have it set to dark theme because that's what I, when I wrote the article, which the article link is right down below. You can go check out the article I wrote about it. Um, but if you like doing the video, just watch the video. So we're going to go down here. So once you do this, you're going to look for this little menu right here. This is the menu. So when you come in here, you're going to look to the top left and it says open navigation, which is basically a menu. And you're going to scroll down. I oh, actually you don't really have to scroll. Um, it's just settings at the very, very bottom here. You want to click on settings When you click on settings. And then this is going to appear settings has appearance, which has the app theme. And then it tells you about what the calculator version is and whatever thing like that. But we want to go to this one. So click on anywhere in here and it pulls down this little menu. And then what you can do is you can change it back to light. There's no save. So you don't have to worry about clicking save or anything like that. So you're going to click on dark, which I like mine on dark. You can use system settings. My default is the light theme. But um, I found out from my editor, he goes, he said that actually his is actually automatically set as dark theme as his default. So whatever the default for your system is, you can always click on that and it'll show you what the default is. And mine is light theme when it's defaulted. So I'm going to stick with dark, pick the one you like, and that's it. You're done. So now you can click out of that. So you want to open your calculator again. I'm going to do it this way instead. I can under C because I know how to do that. And then it pops up. It's always in this nice dark color, which is the way I like it. So that's how easy it is to change your calculator theme in Windows. And this is Windows 10 I'm showing you on, but it also works in Windows 11. It probably works in most Windows, but this is the two I tested it on and it worked perfectly. Hey, thanks for watching and make sure you hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com. Uh, where all, all our articles are and make sure to subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching